Hey guys, Dusty here with another quick tutorial for you today. I'm going to be showing you guys how to create a freeze frame within Final Cut Pro 10. Previously, I've done a video on how to speed up and slow down clips in Final Cut, but uh, today I'm going to show you how to actually freeze a frame if you need to extend it and use it for uh, you know a duration during your video. So as you can see here, what I've done here is I have actually created a, uh, a freeze frame of a, a silhouette that I created for a wedding film that I'm making uh, to end the video or the movie with. So I'm going to show you how I created that and how you can get a freeze frame in your videos. All right, so once you've selected the exact frame that you want to freeze, which is obviously, hence the name, you're freezing a frame. So once you have the frame that you want to freeze and use for your video, go ahead and take the playhead, which is this line here in the timeline, and move it to exactly where you want on the video. So for me, let's say I want to freeze this frame right here. Go ahead and put the playhead exactly where you want it, and then right here where you see the clock icon, hit the drop down arrow, and then go to where you see hold. Now you can hit command H if you want to do it from the keyboard shortcut, but if you hit the hold option here, it's going to bring up automatically a two second clip of that actual frame. So as you can see now, there is nothing happening here, it's specifically just that frame frozen in place. Now, what I normally tell people is play around with this, see how you want to adjust it, and it works very similar to uh, sped up or slowed down clips in that if you want to, you can just click and hold right here and drag it to the right to extend the duration of the clip, or you can drag it to the left to decrease the duration. Now remember, you're going to see that it looks kind of stretched there, the image in the timeline, but whenever you play it back, it's not going to be stretched. And, you know, Again, that'll fix itself with rendering and depending on how fast your processor or speed is on your Mac. So that's how you do a freeze frame within Final Cut Pro. If you want to know how to speed up, slow down clips, do other stuff within Final Cut Pro, hit that subscribe button, like the video, share it with your friends and family, and I will see you guys in the next one.